This is Richard with my missionary update from April 28th to May 18th. And since then, there have been 42 salvations and 184 people witnessed to. I apologize that it's been a while since I made an update. Uh, but I went to the U.S. and I've been back in Uganda for about a week now. But I was able to visit my family and a lot of my friends at Mountain Baptist Church. And I did a little bit of soul winning uh, while I was there also. Obviously, it's not as uh, receptive in the U.S. as it is in Uganda. But, you know, we still put in the work. We still put in the effort. We had some salvations. And almost immediately upon my return, I was invited to preach the, uh, the gospel to a Pentecostal church. This Pentecostal pastor just observed me giving the gospel, and he was fascinated with it. Uh, so he let me uh, preach the gospel at his church can't really verify any salvations because the audience was so quiet and non-responsive, which is the exact opposite of what you would expect from a Pentecostal church. You know, usually they're screaming and yelling and running laps around the church and diving in the baptistry and stuff like that. But they were, you know, this one was actually very uh, calm and quiet. I was also able to preach uh, to a small classroom in a school the rest of the students were on holiday. Uh, the principal said I could come back and preach to the rest of the students at a later time. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, please pray for me uh, as I'm going to be trying to find a church building on Monday. I've got someone that's going to be uh, taking me around to see different places. And just pray that God gives me wisdom to make the right choice and that I don't get ripped off or anything like that. And I'm also still working on getting an NGO permit. Uh, just trying to get the church set up here has been uh, somewhat difficult because every time I go somewhere, uh, they send me to somewhere else or they send me to someone else. But eventually, you know, we'll get it set up, uh, Lord willing. Uh, but God bless everyone. Until next week, thank you for watching.